okay welcome to mobile electronic diagnostic this is again the 20 the 2011 uh, Lincoln I mean Crown Victoria we changed the front uh, engine wiring harness complete okay we just see that we have a check engine light on I need to be sure what we can do for us in order for us decline this I gotta go by VIN number detect to see if we can read the information okay accept remember with that one we are not able with the fourth we are not able to read anything here we have the VIN number I will say okay okay gonna break down the information we just want to know is that crown victoria crown victoria and grand marquis they all the same so this is one i'm gonna go through diagnosis we have light here you see when you start the car i believe there is there is a, a range coming here i don't know is that because of this one or because of something else we are not sure but let's delete the code first and then see what happened. But I know that diagnose. I gotta do auto scan for the whole car. I have 13 percent left. You see, we have in the engine 13 volt, ABS one volt, airbag. I don't believe anything, no fault, which is a good news. In your computer, maybe they disconnect a lot of items. I'm not sure it's still disconnected or we still have to run some items. But I need to clear anything from the car before I have to look for what's going on first. Okay, report. Okay, we have 13 in engine computer, you see? O2 sensor, heater circuit. O2 sensor, heater circuit. We don't have those codes before. O2 heater circuit left upstream exhaust gas recirculation valve position control evap torque converter clutch solenoid torque converter clutch solenoid line 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 pressure electrical SS shift you know like I have a lot of codes so I don't know if this is because they started before I'm gonna go here and I turn the ignition off we don't have those code before. Quick rest. Engine control module, I have one code left. That's weird. Maybe that code for system is not ready. And that we don't consider it code report. Oh. Yeah, this is not a code. This is just it tell you the car is not ready. Tire pressure, tire pressure, and that's it. Driver door module. Driver door module, two quotes. Tire pressure sensor, tire pressure sensor. P0100 is not, it just say that the car is not ready. It's not a quote. It will not turn the ignition on. Okay, I see the tire pressure monitor. Oh, oh. This one here, I don't like it. When you see the, 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 the range, the range sign is not good. So let me go escape. I'm gonna read again, escape this. Okay. I'm gonna scan again. Yeah, 13 fold, that means there is a problem there. You see the BCM have 4, 13 fold. Even though the check engine light is not there, that means either the connector are not well connected. When you have 13 cold, that means either there is a fuse blown or something is not well connected. I, I shouldn't get all this code here. Report. We change the harness, so O2 sensor, heater circuit sensor, heater circuit sensor, 
heater sensor okay exhaust EGR circulation valve evaporative emission vapor management fault torque converter clutch solenoid torque converter clutch solenoid line pressure electrical malfunction okay this is too much this is too much so I'm gonna go here check this 62 48 now 61 maybe a fuse or a connector was not well connected he say O2 sensor circuit heated oxygen heated exit oxygen sensor heater right upstream heater malfunction O2 sensor heated exhaust downstream two of them so all the all the uh, all this are not communicating well i gotta look for codes what's going on and then we come back with uh, what what we see so i'm gonna leave this video here for six minutes the second video is gonna be part three and then we have to look for why all this code you know that we put a brand new wire thank you for watching please subscribe and share